The Chinese PLA will have its eyes firmly fixed on Sydney over the next 10 days. Joining forces are four of China's biggest adversaries in an epic display of power, precision and camaraderie. India, Japan, the United States and Australia are teaming up for the Malabar Naval War Games off Sydney's stunning coast from August 11 to 21st. The exercises have previously been held in the Indian Ocean. Making waves in the deep blue sea, the history of the Malabar naval drills goes back to 1992 when the Indian Navy and the US Navy first held this bilateral exercise. Now it has evolved into an impressive quad of four, with Australia first joining the exercise in 2007 and then rejoining in 2020. Australian F-35 fighter jets, P-8 surveillance aircraft and even submarines are diving in. India's warships include INS Shahyadri, an indigenously built multi-role stealth frigate. It has previously patrolled the Western Pacific and the South China Sea and won the Indian Navy Eastern Fleet's Best Ship Trophy on numerous occasions. While INS Kolkata was inducted into the Indian Navy by Prime Minister Modi in 2014, it's a 6,800-ton monster. This guided missile destroyer is among the largest indigenously built warships in India armed with supersonic cruise missiles like the Brahmos and Barak-8. Measuring 163 meters in length and 17 meters in width, INS Kolkata has a range of over 11,000 kilometers, is equipped with electronic warfare systems and can carry two Sea King or HAL Dhruv helicopters. Warships and aircraft from the US Navy, Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force and the Royal Australian Navy will also join the Indian Navy in flexing their naval muscles. Japanese and Indian Navy ships made waves in the Pacific en route to Sydney, making strategic pit stops in the Solomon Islands and Papua New Guinea, two among the Pacific Island nations. The sea stage is set where the ships will unleash high-intensity exercises covering anti-surface, anti-air and anti-submarine warfare, especially after the friction between Chinese and the US Navy vessels in the South China Sea. China and US friction in the Pacific intensified when Solomon Islands cozied up to Beijing. Raising fears in Australia and New Zealand, both US allies are about a possible Chinese military base in their neighbourhood. There are some 14 independent Pacific Island nations out of which the Solomon Islands and Kiribati switched their diplomatic recognition from Taiwan to China in 2019. The Malabar 2023 exercise isn't just about firepower. It's a chance for the Indian Navy to enhance its skills and exchange insights with its quad partners. Malabar Naval Exercise elevates India's global position too. Beyond military tactics, it's a chance for India to tap into the combat prowess, technological advancements and tactical know-how of both the US and Japan while strengthening the growing bonds of friendship with Australia.